hotels back in the day. So it just go back and forth, and then they call it the hack because that's what you call the model that's what you call a uh, taxi driver back then. Okay, well, then once they switched the name of depot to train station, the star became known as the station wagon. Oh. So the company would call Ford Motor and say we need a depot hack, and they would send them the heart and soul of a Model T, but no body. And the company would hire a separate coach company to build the coach that they wanted according to the specifications that they needed. So for a depot hack, they basically wanted the back area to be ready for luggage. That was what you would have done. You got your choices of three different types of wood. Ash, maple, or oak. This one has to be oak body. Just the timing as you drive? Um, just on startup, no. your uh, advanced timing's right here. No. Um, but you only use your advanced timing to get the car started. Ah. Other than that, you can push the advanced down. And it'll run those but everything you know about driving a car, basically you have to throw it out the window and start from scratch, with the exception of the steering wheel. So you have three pedals on the floor. None of those pedals are the gas pedal. The gas is right here. So, you kind of got to drive the car a little bow-legged, but here's reverse. Not synchro mesh. <laughs> right, yeah. Yeah, it's an interesting transmission, that's for sure. Now back in the day, the transmission bands were made out of cotton. So, most people that have a Model T, Very impressive. 
Um, it gets about 20 miles per gallon. Oh, wow. Um, and you can use basically any fuel you want. So you can go up to your local gas station, put in 87 unleaded, and a big leaded, unleaded, kerosene, Jack Daniels. It really doesn't discriminate. <laughs> gallon tank, so you can go about 200 miles on a gallon. Wow, what a cat. I'm just saying, wow. And then Henry Ford finally said, you know what? I could probably get the cars up the hills a lot better if I put the gas tank out front so it sat taller. Oh, because honestly, these cars, at a certain point going up the hill, you'll never make it. Oh. People would drive their cars backwards. 